as a joke, like oh, making a okay. joke in Kachuma that other people don't make a joke of. But anyway, I should be so harsh and like putting everyone down, but anyway. Um, yeah, so I'm just videotaping him, he's just driving at the moment. Looking hot as with his glasses. Um, is this your video? No, sorry. Right. I want to talk about the afterlife, right? It makes no difference if there's an afterlife or not. When you die, either there's absolutely nothing, therefore it's not good, it's not bad, completely nothing. That's, that's what I think is the case. But if there is a spirit that lives on in heaven or not hell, because hell doesn't exist, um, if there is a heaven, great, there's nothing to fear, if there's absolutely nothing, then there's nothing to fear. You know, so if there is an afterlife, you're still alive in some sense, so you can never die. Um, all you can know is life, right? All you can know is life. You cannot know death because if you're there and you go, I'm dead, well, then you're not dead. There you go. Hi, babe. Go back. All right, sweet. Say, say something. All right. Well, I'd like to say that I hope there is a heaven that all the good people can go to. Especially the young people these days in the generation that we live in where they're stuck on drugs and they have nothing to have, you know, like to live for. So I just pray for all the people, you know, that want to, you know, just be free and go with Jesus, you know what I mean? Like, um, last night I thought when I was sick, I thought, is there really a Jesus that heals people? I said to uh, I said to now Bush, I mean I said to sorry uh, Ian that um, is there the real thing of Jesus? He said yes, there was. So I had a bit of hope. So as I as I've been praying, God's telling me that He does not want me to smoke cigarettes anymore. He wants me to have a, a, a life, and my body is a temple of the Holy Spirit. Right? So <clears throat> God knows that I like to drink. Jim Bean, so sometimes when I'm sick I'll drink Jim Bean, but I won't be smoking anymore because every puff is the last second of your life. Um, Ian likes to smoke, so like that's his that's his decision. But I choose not to because I can't afford it. I've got a little girl that I have to spend money on every every fortnight to a month, and. Um, Peace out to everyone that listens to this tonight. That was good, and you look gorgeous. You should see um, yourself. So, you look stunning. So, yeah. So, he thinks I look stunning. That's a nice thing. But, um, <laughs> yes. Uh, peace out to everyone that's listening to this right now. I hope I give you hope. No, guess what? Guess what? Yes? Um, I'm going to... You know what? You know what's stopping me? People don't like to be filmed. Well... I'm gonna. I'm just gonna film people, and I'm gonna show you how I conduct myself in the public arena. I do not get embarrassed. I'm pleasant. I'm funny. I give what I can. I make people feel good about themselves. You know what the problem is? People can't believe how happy and confident I am in giving and all that, so they diss me and try and turn it into a bad thing somehow. You know, like narcissist, I love I God, I'm beyond my ego. I couldn't give a fuck what I am. I am what I am. Anyway, we're gonna make more fun videos. I'm gonna show you what I've always done my whole life. Doesn't make me crazy. I get off on it. I mostly get a laugh out of people. Um, yeah, so look, I apologize for all these videos not being very good, but they're gonna get good, I'm telling you. Peace out to the world. <laughs>